Hey guys, it's your girl Kels. Welcome back to another video. Today I'll be doing a review on the infamous Moose Knuckle Bomber. Women's Bomber, that is. Before I get into the review, if you haven't already subscribed, make sure you subscribe to our channel. Be a part of the fam. Come on, it's all love over here. And don't forget to hit the notification bell, all right? Let's get into this review. All right, guys, just to tell you a little bit about the brand, Moose Knuckle, it is very known in Canada because it is a Canadian brand. Um, it was founded in Montreal in 2009. They're known for their sleek and modern style, keeping you cozy and warm during the winter. Let's get into the specs right now. I'm gonna go put my jacket on and we'll get into it. All right, guys, so right now I have on the women's bomber. Take a look, take a quick look. Now the bomber is slim fit, so it does hug you in the right places. You don't look too boxy or anything like that. That's what I really love about this jacket. Um, it complements your body. It feels good. It just feels luxurious. The quality is just spectacular. Um, the shell is waterproof, so that's great. The protection rating is amazing. It On the website, it does say that it's a level three, which means that it's made for crazy and cold winter, which is what Canadian winters are all about. I can't say that I've ever been cold in this jacket, ever. And I'm talking about walking outside in minus 20 degree weather with just a t-shirt under. You can literally wear just a t-shirt under this jacket, guys. I'm telling you. All right, so the fur is real fur. It is made out of fox. One thing I didn't really like about the fur, but it was on my bad, was the fact that I got white fur because I thought it was cute, it looked nice. But as you can see, I have red hair. So my red hair from time to time did bleed into my fur. It wasn't too bad, but that would be the only thing that I would say if you have colored hair, it may not be the best thing. But overall, it's it looks great. The hood is detachable, so if you want to wash your jacket in the washer, you can take it off, pop off the hood. The insulation is made out of Ukrainian duck. I don't know what the difference is between a Ukrainian duck or any other type of duck, but I'm telling you, it's warm. They know what they're doing. It's a really warm jacket. This is my fourth year wearing this jacket. I kind of feel like it's my winter uniform because it's the only jacket I wear. It's the warmest jacket I have. I've been wearing it for four winters straight and it hasn't filled me yet. Um, the material, the quality, everything is just up to par. I haven't had any holes, any rips, any tears, nothing along the sort. The quality still feels the same way it did the first day that I bought it. So that just goes to show. Um, when I did purchase this jacket, it was $1,000, $1,090. Um, so it is kind of up there, it is pricey, but is it worth it? I think it is. If you think about it, like your average winter jacket might be $200, $300, but if you're buying a new coat every winter, it ends up being about the same. What I love about this jacket is the simplistic detailing. It doesn't have too much going on, yet it's still sleek and modern. I really like that you got the two welt pockets here, so I know some people like to have their hands up here to keep them warm. You also have the two pockets, lower pockets down here, and you have inner pockets on the inside. Um, one thing that was kind of weird to me that I didn't really know was that you're actually supposed to wear it like this. Oh, you're actually supposed to wear it like this. I didn't know that until I saw somebody wearing it like this the other day and I was like, oh, that's kind of cute. But this is actually the proper way to wear the jacket. So it kind of makes sense. Your neck's warm. This isn't flying all over the place. So just a heads up this is the correct way to wear it. All right, so I definitely recommend this jacket. If I had to rate it out of 10, definitely 10 out of 10, hands down for sure. 
guaranteed if you guys are thinking about getting this jacket don't think twice go out and get it i'm telling you you will not regret it the only thing i would say is try to get the jacket on sale because they are kind of pricey but is it worth it 100 percent i hope you guys like this review don't forget to like share subscribe comment down below let me know do you think the moose knuckle jacket is worth it what type of jacket do you wear during the winters let us know thanks for watching guys peace